The music, the costumes, and the magical setting of the Nutcracker return to the stage next weekend. Ballet Minnesota is prepping for its 34th Nutcracker. Shane Wells joins us with two dancers playing the show's most iconic roles. There it is. That is the Nutcracker that is featured in Ballet Minnesota's production of the classical Nutcracker, of course, 34th year that they're doing this, and we wanted to get a little behind the scenes scoop on what goes into the production. Now, you still have a few weeks, they're busy in preps right now, but we're happy to be able to chat with you ahead of time. We have the human form of the Nutcracker with us, Matthew Halpas. Thank you for joining us. You've done a lot of roles in this production, but this is the first time being the Nutcracker, so that, does that feel like a lot of pressure? A little bit, yeah. So. Having started here when I was eight, you know, it's really been a role I've dreamed of doing for some time now. So to finally do it, it's really a dream come true. And for you, when you perform, you've done it so many times, performing, being on stage. Do you still get nervous? A little bit, yeah. Right, right when the curtain's pulling up and you just see the whole audience out there, your nerves get going. So. Oh yeah, no pressure at all, right? No <laughs> pressure. And also, this. okay, we have Clara. This is the second year that you've done Clara. We have Flannery Page with us. And you've got your Nutcracker with you. What goes into embodying and becoming Clara for this role? Um, I'd say just really you need to tell the story and pretend that you're dreaming everything that's going on in the story um, and just, yeah, experience it as if you are Clara. Uh, just show the audience your joy and your love. Do you have a favorite part in the show? Um, my favorite part would probably be Angels. I really like it because it's after the war scene and the Nutcracker has come to life and I, I just feel really happy during that part. And the audience probably feels that as well. Matthew, do you have a favorite part, part in the show? Right before Angels, probably the war against the Rat King. This really gets your energy up. You're so. the opposite favorites here. Yeah. <laughs> and that war, I was holding that sword a little bit ago. That thing's heavy that's a workout the sword itself is a workout oh for sure you know and jumping around with it and doing turns <clears throat> turns with it sometimes though it really helps you hold your center actually be surprised so I did not think that that would help you at all how many days a week are you guys here Ooh, six I'm here also six so much appreciation you guys put in a lot of hard work it's gonna pay off this is gonna be an amazing show and we appreciate your time because I know you're really busy, so you got to get back to dancing. you got to let them get back to it. Valley Minnesota's Nutcracker is happening one weekend only. It is December 16th, 17th, and 18th. It's going to take place at the O'Shaughnessy at St. Catherine University. If you want to get yourself tickets, you can call the box office at O'Shaughnessy, or you can check out valleyminnesota.org. Back to you.